hello everyone how are you all doing in today's video i want to share with us how you can use any denomination any currency note and salt to attract money to yourself this is the a period where people need money to do one or two things for themselves we are very close to the end of the year people need money to buy cars people need money to pay their bills people need money to travel home people need money to start up their new building or their new projects people need money to finish their project they already started so to begin you are going to get the highest denomination in your currency my own is naira and the highest denomination is 1000 naira so i'm going to get the 1000 naira i'm going to get salt and the salt at the middle of the money like so hold it on your right hand and pray remember your right hand is your receiving hand pray tell god that you want to receive money you want abundance from today henceforth you want your business to flourish you want whatever you lay your hands on to prosper if you're a business person you go to your shop and sleep throughout the day you play ludo you just come back empty-handed when you know you have bills to pray this is for you so after praying tell god how you want your old customers to remember you how you want to open your shop and customers will patronize you you are tired of gisting you are tired of playing in your shop you are tired of sleeping you need customers that is why you are there you are not there to gist you are not there to play lotto tell god to visit you that all these goods around here are for sale you want customers that will come and buy if you have offended some of your customers because of maybe you sold bad goods to them or you had one or two misunderstandings, tell God that wherever they are, let them remember you and come and patronize you. You are going to do better this time around. After that, if and after that, take your bucket of water you want to use to bait. Put this money before you put it, you are going to fold it. Okay? Fold it inside or inwards, like so. Fold it. After for the just drop it in the water and remove the money so it doesn't get damaged. Don't put it there permanently, remove it, just dip it there and remove it. So as from today, money will follow you like water. Tell God to bless you. Let him use showers of blessing upon you. Let him use this water to bless you. Anywhere you go, let, let the fragrance of money follow you. Let the spirit of money follow you. In your business, customers will flow. In your place of work, you get promoted. People around you will favor you. They will give you contracts. Many people have a business that registered their business name, but no contract is coming. You will see big, big companies folding, closing up today because businesses are not coming. And others are opening. As others are closing, people are opening. Those people opening, they don't have two heads. Tell God to visit you. Tell God to expand you. Tell God to send spirit of money to you. You need money to visit you. You need to have a test of it. If you have been, if maybe you have made it before and all of a sudden you are broke, tell God to uh, give you the second chance. Yes, that you are going to invest whatever you are going to make this time around very well. You are going to help people around you that you can help. Pray, you will see money will come. If you're a contractor, contracts will come. If you're a business person, businesses will start flowing. If you are, are the people that have hard work, there are some people that have good hard work, but they don't have people to patronize them. Tell God to send your customers wherever they are all over the world. Your customer can even call you from another state to come and do your work because God wants to connect you. Tell God that you are a tiler, you need customers that will Coming, calling you to tie their house. You are a seamstress. You need people that will bring clothes for you to sew. You are a tailor. You need customers that will come. You are a hairdresser. People don't come to your salon. Why people make care every day? Tell God to send your own customers. You are a school owner. Other people are having much population. You are still borrowing to pay your staff salary. While others are even saving from whatever they make from the school. That is an error. Do this money will come. Magnet money naturally. This you don't need to go and use blood rituals or do blood rituals or do anything evil to magnet money. These are natural things you can do at the comfort of your home without any negative effect. It doesn't have any side effect. These are natural things. You are not stealing from anybody. You are not taking anybody. So what you're taking is what belongs to you. You are attracted from the universe. The universe is too wide that 
Even 10 people can do the same business in the same locality and they will all make it. So tell God that as you have started this business, you are going to flourish. So many people have made it through this business. You are not going to be an exception. You will see people that have made money through the same business you are doing. But for you to even eat is a problem. You cannot pay your bills. Some of you have divorced your wife because you feel that she's the witch after your life. No, she is innocent. Rather, the spirit of money left you because you misuse it. You do not appease it well. You do not carry it well. When money comes, some of you will start doing things you're not supposed to do. You will see responsible men will become irresponsible. They will not live in the hotel with different women. Those women you are living with can attract negative energies that will send that spirit of money away. That is when you start treating your wife like rag. Maybe your wife has been the one praying for you to prosper. You start treating her like nobody. The spirit of money will get angry and leave. So when money comes, be careful how you treat your partner. The same thing applicable to women. There are some women that are richer than their husband. God has given you that opportunity because he feels that you are the better planner. You should not enter your head. You should not make you not to respect your husband. Please ignore the background noise. I don't know what to do to these dogs. Please. So women, once they start making money, they will not respect anybody, including their husband. They will even stop cooking because they feel they have made it, they have arrived. They will stop respecting their husbands. They will stop respecting everybody in the family. That is not good. God has a reason for placing you in that position. So if you're a woman listening to me and God has made you richer than your husband, please do not let it get to your head. Once God gets angry and take it from you, you will struggle with that same results. Most of you, when you have that money, that is the time you will stop doing everything in the house. You won't even support your husband financially when you know he's not capable. You always want him to bring even when he doesn't have. And when he doesn't have, you will not give him food. You will not agree to pay the house rent. Even if you manage to pay, you will make sure that you insult the living daylight out of his life. That is not good. God has a reason for putting you in that position, for taking you inside a family. Because I know that most of you that is going to do this spell, you are going to make money. Don't let the money get into your head. Your business will start moving. You will get promotion. Please remember to always pay your tithe to any church you belong to or anybody that your spirit accepts that is a spiritual person. It may be your pastor or whoever that your spirit accepts. Remember to do that. Remember to visit the orphanage because God is going to bless your business. is going to explore. It's, you know, your business is going to go to another level. Whatever you're doing, you will see changes in your life. Try it and make sure you share your testimony under the comment section or on my WhatsApp number. Please do it for seven days and testify.